The United Arab Emirates UAE is allegedly constructing a new elite military unit according to Global Defense Analyst Intelligence Online. This force, expected to consist of at least 3,000 foreign recruits, aims to bolster the UAE's military capabilities. Led by former French Special Forces officer, recruitment for this new unit is scheduled to take place between mid-2024 and 2025. Managed by Abu Dhabi-based company, the recruitment process offers well-paid positions to young men, signifying a notable shift in the UAE's defense strategy. The force, dubbed the Emirati Foreign Legion, is reportedly intended for deployment in Yemen and Somalia, where the UAE has vested interest but faces significant security challenges. The UAE's Engagement in East Africa has long been cornerstone for its foreign policy encompassing military and economic endeavors. From training Somali soldiers to establishing military bases and undertaking extensive humanitarian and infrastructure projects, the UAE has been an active participant in the region. Analysts suggest that the establishment of the Emirati Foreign Legion aligns with the UAE's broader objective of projecting power and countering threats in the region, particularly from Iran-allied groups like the Houthi movement in Yemen and terrorist functions such as Al-Shabaab in Somalia. However, the UAE's presence and actions have steered controversy, as its military operations and alliances have sometimes clashed with the interests of traditional allies and local sovereignty. Recent scrutiny has focused on UAE's support for Sudanese pra paramilitary group, the Rapid Support Forces, RSF, in its conflict with the Sudanese army. Despite vehement denials from the UAE, a leaked UN report indicated credible evidence of the Gulf country providing military support to the RSF multiple times per week Amjaras in northern Chad. The establishment of the Emirati Foreign Legion raises broader questions about the evolving nature of international military cooperation and private military contracting. The UAE's government's direct recruitment of foreign soldiers for an indefinite period introduces new dynamics into international defense relationship and machinery practices challenging existing norms and regulations.